Hello friends, welcome back to The Dork Side. I'm the dork in the road, and today I'm gonna to share two Yamaha Tenere 700 seat hacks. I'm the dork in the road, and I wanna be your internet writing buddy, so please consider subscribing. So I get a ton of questions all the time, like seriously seven every time I post a picture of it, about this seat pad, and I gotta tell you, it's nothing special. This is a Coleman Mad Dog seat pad. It's for ATVs, they're $20 on Amazon, I'll put a link in the description for you. Some of you old school uh, people who've been around for a while will remember I had one of these on my CRF 250L because I hated that seat so much. So when I got this Tenere and my butt was numb when I got home from the dealership, I was like, I gotta do something. So uh, I ordered the same thing, the old standby, and uh, this thing helps, mostly because it widens the seat out a little bit. It spreads out the weight a little bit more, but it's also got a little cushion to it. Not bad, they don't last forever, but the one I had on the 250L lasted three years. So for 20 bucks, it is worth every single penny of the $20. Let me show you how I mounted it. So the trick is you have to keep this thing clear, right? And these have to be clear. So I always cross the top two straps if you don't cross the top two straps, then you'll have a strap right here in the way and you won't be able to get your seat down. But if you cross them, like I've done here, so just here to here and here to here, it works perfectly well. All this stuff is kind of out of the way. I could actually put this owner's manual holder over the top of it if I wanted to. Just strap it on, tighten it down, cross these two, you're good to go. The other seat hack I wanna show you, did you see how easy it was for me to take my seat off, right? And the stock seat, you actually have to unscrew it. But, and this is not my hack, I actually learned this from somebody who pointed it out to me on Instagram, but um, this is actually the factory hardware. So usually this, this piece right here is upside down and it holds the seat down. But if you pull out the bolt and this spacer thing, um, flip it over and just put them back in upside down like this, you can figure it out. You don't need me to demonstrate that, do you? You can just slide the seat on, pop it down like this, and then put door. What's holding your seat down? Great question. Uh, the passenger seat. So you just put the passenger seat on where it goes and this is going nowhere. And now I can get my seat off and get to the battery without unscrewing, I don't need any tools. So, you know, great if you're trying to run a compressor off your battery, you just wanna be able to get to your battery in your fuse box. That's the way to do it. So, um, two seat hacks for the price of one in one video. Link to the Mad Dog seat pad in the description. And, you know, you know it costs you zero dollars to do the other mod, you just gotta get your Allen key out and flip those bolts over. So, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments. I appreciate you, and uh, please don't forget to be excellent to each other. I thank you. Excellent! Done, nailed it. Cut. Cut, Lil Dork. Lil Dork did. Lil Dork camera person. Yeah, photo quit me. Eh. Thanks.